I am a survivor of domestic violence. I'm not just a victim. Elizabeth Artunian is a survivor on the mission to raise awareness on an issue close to home. The Cal senior from LA launched one of the first courses on campus focusing on domestic abuse and laws. She says she created the class to start a conversation and address the emotional, psychological, and physical toll that abuse carries. Experiencing this sometime in the near, near or far future, and what I can do as a student, as an individual, as a, you know, a daughter, a friend, is just to raise awareness about this. When Elizabeth left her home environment, she says she struggled with the trauma, experienced health issues, and did not know where to turn to. With a sizable enrollment of students in her class now, she hopes others find themselves with more resources to use and share. And it's not to tell them what to do, because they get enough of that on their own. It's to tell them what options they have, how, can they, how they can help themselves. She hopes the class serves as a reminder that domestic violence is not a private familial issue, but a public health one. Before experiencing depression herself, she says she felt the deafening silence around the issue in public. If we can understand it just by talking about it and addressing these very simple but complex questions, which is, why didn't you call the police, then we can steer clear away from these kinds of ideas of domestic violence being something that people can just walk out of. Her class runs weekly and invites experts in law enforcement and counseling to speak to students. I truly believe it's a public health issue because domestic violence affects one in three women globally. Ana Mancia founded the ASUC Intimate Partner Violence Commission as a freshman in 2015. She recently spoke to Elizabeth's class about abuse and recovery. Most of us at some point in our life are going to know someone who has gone through an abusive relationship, if not gone through it ourselves. And so having this type of education, I think, is so crucial. And I'm really happy personally to see this decal on campus, finally. Elizabeth and Anna are set to graduate this semester with the hopes that this crucial conversation does not end when they return home. Reporting for CalTV News, I'm Tomas Maglonia.